Are you considering one of those discount brokerages to list your home? You may want to watch this video. All right, thanks for sticking around. Hey, today we're talking about those flat fee brokerages, those discount brokerages that are out there. And I'm here to tell you three things you need to look for before you decide to go with one of those brokerages. I know you want to save a few bucks. I get it. I understand. I respect that. But here's three things you want to look out for when you're deciding to go with one of those brokerages. Number three, make sure you know what you're going to be paying for when you actually sell your home. All right. So yes, I know some of them are flat fees. Here's Here's a flat fee, they're gonna list it, and that's pretty much all they're gonna do. The other ones are gonna list it for 1%, 1.5%, but guess what? There's gonna be a buyer side as well. So the 1%, 1.5% is just for the listing side. Now you've got a buyer side. If an, another agent brings you a buyer for your property, guess what? You're gonna be responsible for that uh, buyer's agent's commission as well. So typically that's gonna be 3%. So you're ended up paying the 3% plus the 1% or 1.5%. So Keep that in mind whenever you go to list your home. Number two, who's gonna be doing the marketing uh, for your, your property? Well, guess what? It's gonna be you. Who's gonna answer those phone calls, those emails, accept those contracts? Who's gonna be there to let those people in to view your home? You are. Who's gonna answer all those questions? You are. So also keep that in mind when you go to list with one of these discount brokerages. So if you have time to handle all that, great. This might be the perfect fit for you. And number one thing to look out for, make sure that they are marketing your home or your home's actually listed. Uh, I see a lot of these companies, they're actually based in a totally different city. So for instance, there's one uh, down in the Houston area. Well, they'll plug it into that uh, MLS down there in Houston, but you know your home may be in San Antonio, Austin, Dallas, Lake Texoma, wherever. And if they're gonna list it down there in the MLS in Houston, that's not doing you any favors so be aware of that make sure that someone local is going to list your home whether it's a discount broker anything like that make sure they're local make sure they know your market so those are my three things to look for when you're considering one of these discount brokerages number three what are you actually going to be paying for uh, number two who's going to be doing your marketing and number one make sure you're going to market in your local mls all right Hope this helps out. Message me below if you have any questions. Thanks for hanging out, and I'll see you next time. Hey, if you're looking just to get your home uh, listed on Zillow, here's a tip. You can list it on there yourself. You don't need a broker.